Good evening everyone. It's nice to be with you on this Mothering Sunday evening as we gather together for this short service of evening prayer. Today I um, prayed in church this morning for all uh, our community uh, as well, particularly today for those who bear the joy and the responsibility of a mother's love remembering particularly those who couldn't see their mothers today and those who are, whose mothers are uh, departed. And so we begin this uh, short form now of night prayer. In the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Just look back on the day that has passed. Thank God for all the blessings that it contained for us. Thank him for those that we love and those who love us. Holy God, holy and strong, holy and immortal, have mercy upon us. So let us pray. Keep watch, dear Lord, with those who work or watch or weep this night and give your angels charge over those who sleep. Tend the sick, Lord Christ, give rest to the weary, bless the dying, soothe the suffering, pity the afflicted, and shield the joyous, and all for your love's sake. Amen. Visit our homes, Lord, we pray, and drive far from them all snares of the enemy. May your holy angels dwell with us and guard us in peace, and may your blessing be always upon us, through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. And now we pray for those who have contracted the coronavirus. God of healing and hope, in Jesus, you meet us in our places of pain and fear. Look with mercy on those who have contracted the virus, on any who are vulnerable and on all who feel in danger. Through this time of global concern, by your Holy Spirit, bring out the best, not the worst in us. Make us more aware of our interdependence on each other and of the strength that comes from being one body in you. Amen. And we remember at this time our government as they bear the responsibility for decision making that has so many consequences. Loving God, in Christ Jesus, the servant of all, you call us to the service of others. Grant to those who govern our nation the skills to recognise its urgent needs and the strength to pursue the common good. Endow us all with patience and courage that we may care for the suffering, feed the hungry, shelter the homeless and sustain the needy through Christ our Lord. Amen. O Lord, support us all the day long of this troublous life. Until the shades lengthen and the evening comes, the busy world is hushed, the fever of life is over, and our work is done. Then, Lord, in your mercy, grant us safe lodging, a holy rest, and peace at the last. Amen. And finally, a prayer for us all. God of all care and compassion, you take us through deep waters, but never abandon us in the storm. We walk in the dark, but you never leave us without light. Be with us in the night of our anxiety and in the day our overconfid in our overconfidence so that we may keep faith with each other as you have kept faith with us. In Jesus Christ our Lord, 
Amen. And so the Lord bless you and keep you. The Lord make his face to shine upon you and be gracious to you. The Lord lift up the light of his countenance upon you and give you peace and strength. And may Almighty God bless you, the Father, the Son and the Holy Spirit. Amen. I hope you all have a restful night's sleep and I look forward to speaking to you again tomorrow morning. God bless.